guys, welcome back to another video, and in today's video, scoot that out of the way, you might get a little sneak peek if you can tell by the boxes, but in today's video is our 200 subscribers special, so I'm going to be showing you the um, briars that I got for Christmas, and it's a lot of them, so this video might be kind of long. So get ready, I hope you're excited. Again, please keep sharing, because I, I am so happy. We are beating Griffin. We're at, I think last time I checked, 236 subscribers, and he is at 209. So, all we have to do, just keep subscribing, keep sharing these videos, and hopefully we win. So let's get into it. All right, guys, so I'm gonna start, I guess I'll start at the top, and I'll save the rares for last, so tune in keep watching. So, this first set, they are not a Christmas horse, you probably saw some of them, but it's a, it, it's two of them, a mare and full set, and they are unicorns. I believe they released three or two or three of these sets, but my parents got me this one, and I'll save the fall for in a second. But she is stunning, and the sunlight shining on her is kind of, like, it's just beautiful. And if you can see up close, she's shimmery. I don't know if y'all can see or not. She's shimmery. But just beautiful. The tail, the mane, all beautiful. And her cute little face. And if you thought she's cute and beautiful, get ready for her fall because it is even more adorable. We'll set her down there for a second. And oh my gosh, y'all, I love this mold so freaking much. Look at how cute the baby is. And comment down below if you know their names because I have not looked yet. And this mold has got to be my favorite mold ever. Like, I just love the little laying down fall. I do not have a laying down fall yet. So I just, I was so excited. And the face on this little baby is so cute. So yeah, that's the first one. Here are them together. A cute little pair. And again, comment if you know their name. Cause I, oh, I'm very sorry, Miss Mare. I'm um again comment their names if you know them because I have not checked yet. So let's get into the next one. Hey guys, sorry, I just got back from eating lunch, but here is the next horse. And oh my gosh, this might be one of my favorite decorator models. I have ever had. It is a the 2022 Christmas decorator. If you look closely, you can see snowmen and trees on it and stars and oh my gosh, I just love it so so much. And those eyes are stunning. Let me get my thing to focus. But I just think such a beautiful model. They're like a sapphire blue. And the mane and tail are like silvery and it's really pearly and kind of glossy feeling and I just really overall love this model so so much um if it I don't know if it has a name either comment down below if it does but oh my goodness I love this model so so much guys the next one we've got I love the box so so much super pretty um, it's got horses, candy canes, I think a little holly on it, and it says to and from, and it's so, so cute. I got this from my Nana, as well as that last one I just showed you. And the back is just plain, and it opens up like a present, and I just love it so, so much. And let me open it up for you. Make your guesses on what it was, because I'm pretty sure this box was exclusive to this model. All right, you got your guesses? You got your guesses? All right, it is Cole the Christmas Pony. And, at, okay, I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I didn't think I was gonna like this one, but oh my gosh, I love it so much. I didn't realize that it was a traditional model, I'm pretty sure, because it's way bigger than a classic. It's, I think it's a he, it might be a she, I'm not sure. Um. She ha he, I'm just gonna call it a he. He has a beautiful little face, so cute. I love the Christmas blanket with the Briar logo right there. And has these Christmassy braids, oh my gosh. I just love this one so much, it's so cute. 
kind of in a cantering mold. I just really like this one so much. There's the other side. Get the cute little um, face marking, a stripe. Got stockings on all the legs. Correct me if I'm wrong, actually those might not be stockings. But um, so yeah, this one is just so freaking cute. So let's move on to the next one. Hey guys, this next one is not a Christmas model, not a unicorn, and I just really like it. My Nana got me this one too, and get ready because it's Battlefield Angel HP, and if you actually read the back of the box, it'll tell you that this is a Frisian horse, and at home goes by the name of Ezra, so just super cute, um, really advanced in dressage. Um, yeah, it tells a lot about the horse on the back, and Frisians are just so cute to me. So, I saved the box for you guys to see on the sides, just yellow, you know. The front, super cute, says, um, his name, and then a picture at the bottom, and then the back, of course, has the picture and, like, about him. So, yeah, super cool box. So let's get this thing open. I'll get the y'all um, back to y'all in a second when it's open. Guys, I'm just pulling him out. And I love this model so much. And of course, this is not the first time I've opened this one either. But I just love how cute. Oh my gosh, that's my dog in the background. Penny, penny. Um, so this is him. Super cute, kind of got like a longer face and the ears are pricked up. Um, beautiful long mane, um, a little bit of black near the top, really detailed with the little neck wrinkles. Um, it, he is a pinto, I think, like a paint horse, and has that beautiful black tail that fades into gray, and I love that so much. And then very long, like thin legs, with feathery feet, which I think is so cute. I just overall love this model. It has kind of like, almost like a snip right here, kind of long though. And this one is just so beautiful. It's a rather a really big one, so I just really love this model so much. So let's get into the next one. Guys, we have two more, and I said I'd save the rarest for last, so let's go ahead and do the big one. Not the rares, but the big one. Probably one that you guys are gonna wanna see. And that is, make your guesses, make your guesses. Can you tell by the box? Can you tell by the box? That's right, it's Snowbird. Oh my gosh, this model is so beautiful. I love the Christmassy box. On the back it says a little bit about it. And then some other things they sell. And she is just so pretty. Um, I really am glad I got this model. My Nana got me this one as well. And she is just such a beautiful horse. I love the feathering and the flowers on the back. So let's just take her out and so you guys can see her. All right, guys, I got her out. I have not taken off the plastic, but there, actually it might be a he, I'm not sure. But there he is in all of his glory. See, there's just a little bit of plastic right here. I usually don't take that off, but you know. And this, it kind of slides around a little, but it, I think it goes in the front since there's not one on either side. And the feathering is just so beautiful. Kind of has like these metal beads in it as well. And a beautiful array of flowers on the back. And this horse just looks royal, like royalty. Um, don't mind that sound in the background, that's my garage. Mm, there goes Penny. But I just, and the blue gems all over just make this horse so beautiful. And its mane and tail is a gray, fades into kind of a white. I just love this model so, so much. A great one to add to my collection of Christmas horses because I only have two other than this one. I have Yuletide Greetings and her name was Celestine, I think, um, from 2019 and 2020, I think. I'm not sure, but 
this horse is just so beautiful. I'm definitely going to have to get the Christmas horse for next year. So let's get into the next. Oh, first face is so cute, by the way. So let's get into the next model. All right, you guys. This next one is probably one of the rarest briars I have. Could be the rarest briar I have. <laughs> and I'm just super excited about this one. I, it was one I put on my Christmas list. My parents got me this one and I was just so excited. So I would like everybody to meet Reverence Plus. Such a beautiful horse, a half Arabian Pinto. And I just love this model so freaking much. So, so cute. And it is a glossy one. I wanted a glossy because I don't have too many glossy horses. This will be my first glossy um, regular horse, you know, not decorated. So I am so excited about this one. So let's get her open. Guys, I'm going to hold her by her hooves so that I don't get her very filthy. And oh my goodness, I love this mold too. I don't have one in this mold yet, so I really like it. Such a sweet little face. You know how Arabians are like have the curved kind of nose and the swoosh tail and how she's kind of pawing the air. Wait, actually, is there a boy or a girl? It is a boy. Super duper cute. And the mane on this horse is so gorgeous. And in real life, actually a very well-rounded horse. I think I read um, like a champion in a lot of different things he is. Um, so that is super duper cool. Ouch, Snowbird just fell on my foot. <laughs> Excuse me, Snowbird, you goofy horse. Anyways. Um, <laughs> So I love the pattern on this one too. A beautiful buckskin with kind of black stockings here. Oh my gosh. And then the little white socks in the back. I love this so, so much. Oh, and on the bottom it says Briarfest 2021. And I really like that because that's cute. Wait, does Snowbird say anything on the bottom? Yeah, it says Briar Happy Holidays and it might say the year. Hold on. Yeah, it says Briar Happy Holidays 2022 very faint gold but yeah um that's cool so this is I just love this horse so much thank y'all so much for watching please subscribe if you're not already because we have successfully taken the lead in this race to 1,000 subscribers so please share this video subscribe and go check out my channel and just thank you all so much for getting us here and i'm just super excited for what's to come next so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one oh goodbye